sowing the word, hearing the word, integrating the word, and living the word. Kind of the theme of our readings this Sunday. We've all had this kind of experience. This happened a couple weeks ago at Mercy Home. I, at lunchtime, I never walk through the door of the cafeteria. Those who know me here know that. I always go through the back door and I go through the kitchen and I want to check out everything, how things are going, what we're having for lunch, talk with our cooks who are wonderful, and then I go and I eat. Well, I walked in the kitchen and there was Carlos standing there. And he was wearing a chef's outfit, preparing food. And it was one of those, where am I? Because Carlos left here about a year ago. Carlos came from a family that had a lot of hardship. His mother was a wonderful woman. There was no father. They grew up in a tough environment in the city. They grew up in poverty. His sister lived down at our girls' campus, and he lived at our boys' campus. He had a great interest in food and culinary. And, and so he did well in high school, and after high school, we sent him to culinary school. And he did very well. And he would come and he would work in our kitchen. That was his job here at Mercy Home. And he did it beautifully. It was like a prep chef going to school, and then eventually became a chef. Great kid. I walk in and there he is, and he's working in the kitchen. So I, it was one of those things, I'm like, what are you doing here? And then I asked him, I said, what are you doing here? <laughs> he, he said, well, Father, he, he said, today's my day off. I said, okay. And he said, so I'm coming back and I'm volunteering. I'm helping in the kitchen. I want to give back. Well, can you imagine how that felt? He wanted to give back, volunteering on his day off. I just, my heart lit up. I, I, I told the story all around Mercy Home. Here's this young man who lived here. He experienced what the home had to offer. He learned a great skill set and a trade and went to school and now he's a chef and he wants to pay back. He heard the word, he took in the word, he integrated the word. It became a part of who he is that to be a faithful follower of the Lord, we use our gifts and our talents and we give back out of generosity of heart. Some days here at Mercy Home are just terrific. Actually, most of them are. 